Hey, welcome to another episode of Tops with Madden JV. When making the Clamps website, I came across an issue with HTML5 media not working in Safari. I looked all over the web, tried to see if there was errors in my code, but I just couldn't find out what the problem was. Now, later on, I did find out that Safari doesn't natively play HTML5 media on its own. It's not standalone Safari. It requires QuickTime installed. This only occurs uh, with Windows because Windows doesn't come with QuickTime installed natively but um yeah in this tutorial I'm just going to show you how you make a catch event for this so you know just open up your whatever you use to code with now in this tutorial I'm assuming that you already know how to use uh, jQuery and modernizer and how to set up HTML5 media in the first place so all you do is just um, the typical document dot ready function, and then what we do is we put an if statement, and we're going to use is um, we're going to use the browser check implemented in jQuery. Now most developers may say ooh because you know if they don't think it's right but this is the only way I've worked out how to do it. You know if you've found another way of catching Safari support then you know just leave a comment at the bottom. But all I'm going to do is put jQuery.browser.webkit and we want to alert. Alert yay. And you know, this setup here. Run, just refresh it. Ah, yeah, I haven't saved this from the last time. So, yay. So, about that. But it works in Google Chrome. What we want to do is to check whether it works in Safari or not. So what we just do is put another if statement inside here, and then if put if not modernizer spelt like that dot audio another alert statement here. Let's put sad. And then now when you check in Google Chrome, you find out you get no statement. However, when you check in Safari, you get sad. So you know that's just a way of checking whether your user is having this problem. Now obviously you can create your own custom custom um, message like I have here. But you know, because this will be a nicer feature than a typical alert box, which some users may say is lazy. Well, I've been Luke Medanga, you know, subscribe, not subscribe, follow us on Twitter at official underscore WLS. And thanks for watching.